a little bit of leftover rain uh, out of these storms moving off to the east. Kaufman County releasing the bulk of that, but the majority of us are dry, so that's some good news. We do have a little bit of light rain around Dallas County, it looks like. Kaufman, though, certainly seeing the heaviest, and uh, it looks like most of the Metroplex, Denton and Collin County dry, a little bit of that light rain moving out of East Fort Worth right now. Kaufman, though, blinding rain. That's some tough rain to get through if you do have to travel that way this morning. Kaufman uh, over towards, headed towards Van Zant County. We'll continue to see some of that heavy rain around Kemp as well. So just know that that's the main thing is going to be the downpours and then the lightning occasionally involved there. Nothing severe. These storms are all racing off to the east as we see our cold front to swing through. And what that's going to do is help to clear things out for us, not just in the way of our rain, but also in the way of clouds. We're going to see these clouds kind of stick around through the morning and probably midday too. still some uh, cloud cover hanging around. But then by the afternoon, we're starting to clear those out. We'll get some afternoon sunshine in here and a cooler, nicer day today. Temperatures running about 10 to 15 degrees cooler than yesterday with a lot more sunshine on the way as we head into Wednesday. Current conditions, though, right now as we take a view from Dallas, you can see the raindrops hitting the camera lens there. Uh, some of that light rain that is falling, 72 degrees north winds up to about 20 miles per hour. So it is going to remain breezy, especially this morning as our cold front heads through. And we're watching as those temperatures drop off. The cooler air still back off to the northwest, starting to see 60s appear for places like Decatur at 60. Most of us, though, still in the 70s, and I do expect we'll keep dropping off as that front passes through this morning. Rain chances go to way down this morning. We'll see only about a 10% chance by 11 o'clock, and then we're losing the rain altogether this afternoon, as well as those clouds. Highs today in the upper 70s, really, really comfortable. Then we will warm up as we head into Thursday, but that's ahead of our next front that passes through Friday. That will spark some scattered showers and storms, not overly widespread, so not everyone getting in on Friday's rain. What we all get in on, though, is a cool down 70s in the forecast, believe it or not, heading into this Mother's Day weekend. Karen, what do you think about that? Uh, this mom loves it. I'm so, so glad.